Our story isn't one of love at first sight. It is one of colleagues that turned into a close friendship for years, and these two friends fell madly in love. Knowing you for so long as a friend, I got to know the fun-loving person you are with attractive and contagious energy. But I feel privileged to have fallen in love with you. We've accomplished so much in our relationship so far, and I am so excited to take this next step with you. I know in our lives we will have hard times ahead. This is my vow to you that I will be here through it all. McKenna, I think it's fair to say that neither of us would have pictured this moment when we first met. It's also fair to say our love story doesn't follow the Hollywood script of those rom-coms you so adorably cherish. It wasn't the classic tale of love at first sight or that chance but fateful random encounter that brought us together. That's because our relation began simply as friends. We got to experience all the simple but genuine kindness of the heart gestures along with each of our quirky tendencies. I am so privileged I can be my true self around you and your true self I have fallen deeply in love with. I vow to have the patience you have shown me every day and to have the unwavering loyalty that you've shown me since I met you. I vow to always be honest with you and I promise to never get complacent in our relationship or take you for granted. I promise to never let your sacrifices go unnoticed. I promise to celebrate your highest accomplishments and I promise I'll keep nodding my head and pretending to understand your theories on bank failures because I know you're so passionate about what you do. And no matter how old we get, I promise to keep us young at heart. I've traveled and I've seen a lot of the world and I've experienced many things, but by far, Jeremy, you are my greatest adventure and I cannot wait to see what the future holds for us. I promise to comfort you with compassion and patience and in the hard times and difficult times we will undoubtedly face. I vow to take care of you, support you, and be present when you need me. Finally, I promise to be your best friend, your partner in crime, your advocate, your lifelong commitment. Most importantly, I promise to love you unconditionally. My baby just got married to a great guy here. It is said, when your children find true joy, the parents find true joy. And here's to your true joy and ours. Twenty-three years of friendship have been the most special, exciting, and memorable years, and we cannot wait for another 50 years to come. You two are truly a perfect match, both on and off the court, um, and complement each other in every way. I admire your love for one another, and I feel so honored to be able to stand by you two tonight as you become one. Jeremy, I am so honored to be by your side today, and I can't tell you how much I value our friendship. We've helped each other through so much, and I'm honored to be your best man. 
But really, I would be remiss if I didn't acknowledge the two best men that are looking down today and smiling on you. I can speak for all the groomsmen, be money, and your pops that are all so damn proud of you. You two complete each other, and we cannot wait to see not only what you harvest in your garden together, but what you grow <laughs> in your future lives together.